We good? <laughs> I'm back. Which is... I just got pop might need to refresh in chat just in case anyone doesn't know. All right, well, I guess that's different. <clears throat> it was all fine for a minute, and then my whole thing just went weird. Alduin crashed my stream. That's what you sound about cars. Oh, so, like, the most expensive bit out of those four will be the insurance and the gas. The car is obviously, like... Unless you want to get, a, like, a brand new car, you'll probably be able to get something that's not, like, too demanding price-wise. Um, depending on your needs. The license is obviously a one-off payment, so it's not, like, the worst. But, yeah, I, like... That's the thing. Like, my, for me... I know driving isn't as bad as it sounds. But I absolutely... Oh, wait, am I supposed to do this again? Oh, wait, I've done the wrong one. Huh. <laughs> Um, for me, I absolutely hate, uh, I really dislike the idea of driving. The responsibility, I'm like, it makes me too anxious and somewhat terrified. Um. And that's like my biggest thing about not driving, is that. I get, I'm too anxious just thinking about it. If I could get over that anxious part about it, thing is about driving is you can be the most responsible driver ever. Yeah, it's, it then comes down to someone else entirely, doesn't it? Pace is one careless idiot. I mean, you're not wrong, but I'm not thinking of it in like that sense. I'm also thinking about being able to like deal with driving myself. But yeah, you're absolutely right. I don't know if maybe I just need to try driving once and see how I feel with it. I'd have to renew my provisional license because that's expired. Getting your driving license doesn't mean you need to get yourself a car and pay for insurance, etc. This is true, because even Rubes was like, what well, you might be better off is getting your license, but then renting a car whenever you want to do a trip. Which sounded like a pretty decent idea, to be fair. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, there's definitely ways and stuff. I, I think it's just the way that my mind goes. I'm like, I'm just like, I can't get over the fact that I'm just slightly terrified about it all. Oh, shit. I thought I had enough time to heal, but I didn't. All right, I think I have to stick with the one-handed then at that point. But yeah, if I can like somehow just get past that a little bit, I think I'll be fine. But yeah. Because my mate Ben said that his girlfriend started learning to drive. And she was the same. Like, she was really anxious and, like, unsure about driving at all. But now that she is, she's completely fine. So I'm like, I don't know. Plus, the idea of if I could drive, I could just drive up and see Rubes. And I don't have to worry about a train that costs, like, 100 quid. I could probably get up there and that much in petrol, if not like half of it or something, maybe. Depending on the car. So it's like. Mm. Yeah. I should just tell myself it'd be okay.
but your boy's a bit terrified of things. Especially if they're out of my control. Which, you know, I can't really do anyway. Like, that's just life. <coughs> Be nice to have proper spaces to practice around, but I found most annoying. I don't even know if I wanted to. Like, I don't even know how I would do it around there anyway. I know there's a bunch of, obviously, driving schools, but I mean... In the sense of, like, it would be nice to have, like, an open space to, um, just try out. Just, I know for sure if I drove, I'd get an automatic. I don't want to have to deal with any of that manual bullshit. I struggle with learning as it is. I don't need to have to worry about a manual and a bloody clutch. Can you stand still so I can shout you? Please. Got him. Come down here. We did it! This was a mighty deed. I don't think what don't I get any dragon bones for that? <laughs> Cleansed his sovereign guard of his evil snare. They will sing of this battle in Shores Hall forever, but your fate lies elsewhere. When you have completed your count of days, I may welcome you again with glad friendship to uh. join the blessed feast. When you are ready to read. Wait, I just realized my thing says day twenty, day twenty one. That should be day twelve. <laughs> Return now to Whoops. 
Let me just change that. <laughs> We've not been playing Skyrim for 21 days. There we go. <laughs> I was going to say, whoops. <laughs> I know for a fact we haven't been playing in 21 days. Oh, hello. I've got a dragons. So many dragons, I know, right? I don't even get a pet, a single one of them. Just not on. No regrets, Arduin had to be destroyed. Of course. Arduin Wachlan Dani. I would not have helped you if I thought otherwise. You did what was necessary. Arduin had flown far from the path of right action in his Pachlok, in the arrogance of his power. But I cannot celebrate his fall. He was my brother once. This world will never be the same. I was just feeling uh, the world is a better place without Alduin. At least it will continue to exist. I'm pretty sure if I remember, there's a quest where you have to kill Parthenax. But I never do it, because I don't see the point in killing him. Sorry, I don't mean to keep you on <clears throat> The last of what you will write upon the currents of time. I feel younger than I have in many of the dark are now scattered across the south. Without Alduin's lordship, they may yet bow to the Vaxen, brightness of my doom. Alright, well just make sure you get consent before you show you them your foom, alright? What do I do now? Oh. Hello. As for myself, you've broken your mastery twice over. Truly, Dovaki, I gladly acknowledge the power of your thing. Zu or Davi, call me when you have need, and I will come if I can. What's 
what's actually the point of calling the dragon after the quest is done? Am I actually done? I don't know. Is that just the end of the main quest line now? I thought I had to go talk to someone to let them know it was done, but I might be wrong. Alright, well, let's start the next quest line then. Let's do, go do the bro Dark Brotherhood. So we've now done the main story. So now we start the next of my favorite. So I'll do the... Uh, if we do Dark Brotherhood, and then we'll do the Winterhold, and then the Companions... Main story is done as far as I recall. I thought I had to talk to someone to let them know shit was done. So. Eh. was that quest that we started when we first got into this game where i was getting owned by the draugr i think i could go do that one now i know it's not a i know it's not a guild quest but i might go do it just so i can shut them up now it was there we go and then i've got a dragon claw Oh, can I get rid of the Elder Scroll? <clears throat> like, how, how do I get rid of the Elder Scroll exactly? Can I just... For some reason, I thought it was locked in my possession. I can't. How the fuck do I get rid of it then? I've got to have 20 weight constantly stuck now. That doesn't sound right. That's the one. Ruins ahead means old traps and bone walkers. All right, back. I'm going to ruin them. Maybe it was this way.
Oops. How goes the adventures? We just finished the main story. Um. Hey, that's but. But welcome in. Yeah, we just wrapped up the main story. Um. So I want to do this quest because it kicked my ass at the beginning, and now I'm definitely good enough to do it now. And then I'm going to start the Dark Brotherhood stuff. I definitely think I can beat Skyrim before the end of the year. Considering I'm only doing the main stuff, the guilds and the DLC. I think we should be fine. Especially where, like, over Christmas there's going to be some big streams of this. Yeah, how you doing, Neff? Krunk was in here early, and I wished him the best with keys. So, I wish you also the best with keys. Hey. I'm here. Yeah. I know, I could sense your amazing presence, Crunk. Yeah, this is the place I got cornered in this room and I was killed. Yes. I remember. I don't know, I just got back. Still a bit meh. Oh well, we'll continue on. Did you um get all of your like uh, uh, slob stuff sorted? It's weird that a ghost drops this because it was a ghost. It wasn't wearing armor. Oh, check me out. <laughs> My mum was really nice. She got gifted some Lindor chocolate meth at work. And she's given them to me. Well, actually, I don't know why she has. Because she loves Lindor chocolate. Don't be meh. This is true. But, you know, sometimes it just overwhelms. And at that point, you surround yourself by lovely people. And it should hopefully slowly fade away. What's this strength potion I got? Oh, I'll use it. Why not? Get rid of these, because I don't like them anyway. Ignore the skooma. I don't have skooma. If you thought you saw skooma, you didn't. Forget about it. <laughs> Oh, although I, I'll post a question to anyone in chat. Anyone who has played Skyrim, what is your favorite guild? Like to do quests for? I have to go down. No. Oh, 
know, I was thinking about this the other day. It's kind of weird that there isn't, like, a repair option on Skyrim. Or, like, you know, the other Elder Scrolls games. Because Fallout has it quite a lot. Like, the whole repair of stuff. So, it's just thought it was weird that they have it in Fallout, but they don't really have it in this. Especially with... Oh, shit, I picked something up that I didn't want. Did you do the major ones? Majors, Fees, Brotherhood, Fires. That's the only ones, isn't it? The only other one that I know of, but isn't really a quest line, is the uh, the Bard College. That's when I was out there and he slipped on the ice and fast. I thought was, no, I can't fool Panda's not here to laugh. Ah. <laughs> oh. You think that I would laugh if I saw you fell out, fall over? Is that what you think of me? I mean, you're not wrong. But I'd, I'd laugh in a very caring manner. You know? Like, I'd laugh as I'm bending down to help you. <laughs> and I'd expect no less from anyone that also sees me fall over in person, honestly. Because I'd also be laughing at myself if I fall over. I always do. It's the only way to get past it. Unless I'm on my own, in which case it's normally one where I'm like looking around and I'm hoping I didn't see someone, just, someone didn't just see me. I've not only got my music in and I'm like, <laughs> I don't have a care in the world until I slip or hurt myself or twist my ankle. And then I'm just like slowly looking around a little bit like, did anyone see that? Can I just play it off like nothing happened? There's a trap. How do I activate this trap? Don't step on it, orc man. Oh no, he's getting... Don't get in the way. Well, I'm, I'm glad the thought of me laughing at you falling over cheered you up a little bit, I guess. <laughs> oh, it's, oh, fuck it. I loved that video I sent you the other day of the people slipping in that same spot. <sighs> I know it's mean. It just brings such a joy to me. <laughs> and I don't discriminate. You know? I'll laugh at anyone falling over. It's like when I was out uh, on my walk yesterday, I messaged Neff. There was like I was on my I was on my walk walking through the park, and this woman had like the most feistiest dog. Like it was like running around like crazy, yanking her all over the place. And then when it saw me, it nearly pulled the poor woman over trying to get to me. And it wouldn't even come over to me to get pets either. Like it would come, it would yank her over to get close, and then it would just run away and yank her back the other way. <laughs> Poor woman. It was a cute as fuck dog though. I also noticed a lot of people in my town has a. Uh... Oh my god, what's it called? It's the dogs that sort of have like a squished face. But the the name of them is not with me right now. French Bulldogs. That's it. There's a lot of French Bulldogs in my town. And I wouldn't necessarily thought I was a fan of French Bulldogs, but they're actually kind of, you know, like, some of them are kind of cute. Or get him. Who 
Oops. Oh, Mr. Gobash! <laughs> Whoops. He's fine. I think. I'm actually really looking forward to going on my walk tomorrow. The only problem is, where it's been cold, there's not really been, like, too much about to take pictures of. Because it's not even like the scenery's, like, changed up or anything, because it's still the same. So I still take my camera out everywhere I go, but it's just not necessarily going to be pictures. One. That's not bad damage. I found that apparently the Nightingale bow is like the best bow in this game. Apparently. I do like the Conjuration one though that you told me to go find. It's always stuff like Sunrises. Yeah, but I, I don't really like... I'm not up for those. Or, like, there's not, like, a massive, like, good spot to get them in my town. That's why I like there when there's, like, loads of animals, because I can take animal pictures. I love taking pictures of animals. I need to go to the zoo. But. They're just not easy to get to. <laughs> Another reason why if I drove, so much easier. I could just drive to the zoo on a whim. Because my closest zoo is Marwell. And even if you caught a bus, you'd have to walk, like, quite a bit as well, I believe. You have to, like, there's only actual buses drop you off there during the summer. But I ain't been to Marwell in ages. Yeah, pro probably be a uh, time location map for those. Yeah. <clears throat> those sort of things, like, is a cool idea, but do it, actually doing them is another thing for me. I could be up early enough to go do it, but it's more about, like, getting there, like, into a good spot of finding it. And, yeah. I only really have the weekends to do stuff like this. It's fine. I'm still happy with the pictures that I do get to take at the moment. Wait. Did I miss a path? Oh shit, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I 
I've been taking some really nice pictures of Malia though recently on my phone. My phone camera is actually pretty decent. So I was quite happy about that. Please, I don't really want that. Well, no, I have been loving my new phone, so that's a good thing for me because. I wasn't sure how I was going to be. Where well, I don't really pay attention to mob uh, to like phones anymore. I have no clue what's decent. So this time I just sort of went with something that I've been wanting for a while. I was like, hopefully this will be all right. It paid off, so. Yeah, fingers crossed I'll have some different sort of pictures for you all next year for those that do like looking at my camera stuff because I know one of the things that I that I think mum said she's going to get me for Christmas off my list was like these filters that go on my camera lenses so it should change things up a bit I need to also like plan out. I want to go to more places. I would like to travel a little bit more next year. Maybe go some places I haven't been before. Cardiff is on that list because I can get a train straight there from Romsey, luckily. But places that I can go direct from Romsey without changing is pretty limited. The other day, I showed Kiki a picture of the frozen lake. Oh, yeah, you were saying Kiki didn't realize it was frozen, right? Holy shit. <laughs> yeah, I had to tell him it was frozen. Yeah, I think it's just one of his face. He's just not used to it, is he? I think he quite enjoyed when I done my little video tour around my town. I'm tempted to try and do it on Discord. Because like, I said that I would like to do like an in real stream, didn't I? Ow. No, I haven't saved in ages. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Hey. Oh, yeah, she went into a new area. Ah, never mind. I was panicking over nothing. I'd imagine people not haven't seen ice. I mean, I think he's seen ice, but like, as in a whole lake frozen? Probably not. Just be one of them things. I've seen a couple of, uh, not lakes, but like small rivers frozen at the moment. But like, I'm talking really small. Nothing like massive or major. Yeah, no. In the places that I was looking at going, I've got, like, three ideas so far. Like, I wouldn't mind going to Cardiff to see what Cardiff's like. 
Um, that I can go direct, luckily. Uh, Bristol Temple Mees, I wouldn't mind trying. Let's see what that's like. That's also a direct train, luckily. Uh, Solar said Colchester's really nice. So, I want to go there. And apparently there's a zoo, so that's a plus. Because you all know I fucking love my zoos. Um, I also still wouldn't mind going to Manchester once as well. Uh, the river here is frozen as well. Not like skate on it frozen, but a thing layer. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know what you mean. I've seen like the videos before where someone's like, let's try skating on it. And they don't realize how like thin it is. And then they just go straight through and it's fucking hilarious. Obviously, they're fine after. You know, no one was harmed in the, f in the making of this video. Um... Those things make me laugh, though. Because you just think people would, like, check this stuff out first. Have, like, a bit of common sense. You know? Maybe that's silly of me to think that, though. You've been to Monkey World? I feel like I have. The name definitely rings a bell. Whereabouts is it? I did. It was the other day, actually, that I saw that there's a train that you can get a train to Bewley, and I haven't. Heard, I've forgotten about Bewley existing. Been so long since I've ever been there. I just forgot it was literally a thing. Dada's Dorset had a real popular series yonks ago. I'm pretty sure I might have been there, at least once, in my past. Rings a bell. Don't. Oh my god. Why is he walking along it? He might die. He's not a clever man. I'm going to go again. Love my visit. If I did, it was probably when I was quite young. There's, um, I don't know where it is exactly location wise. But I remember, like, years and years ago, I went to a Birds of Prey place. I just don't remember where it is. But that couldn't have been too far. I've also been taken to Legoland once as well. Yes, Neff. Pigeons of prey. <laughs> I mean, they might have. I just remember going there and holding owls. Because I held a snowy owl. And then I held a... Uh... Might have been a tawny. There was a chance to hold a vulture as well, but I said fuck that because they're massive. I didn't like the look of it. It gave me a look, and I didn't like that look.
I would like to see in Holden Arrow. We will have to arrange that one day, for sure. It is a fun experience. Oh, I stepped on something. If I live near it, I want to go see that poisonous garden on these ones. That'd be pretty dope, actually. Yeah. I'm assuming there's quite a few of them about. Oh, my health is so low. I didn't even realize. Fuck me. We need to stop that thing. Oh, bloody hell. Come keep telling one keeps hooting outside my house. I'm so sick of it. <laughs> uh, now, where is it? A bird of prey show near us somewhere, I think. Yeah. Maybe down Cornwall, I forget. My brain. I don't think it was Cornwall. I mean, to be fair, this is when I used to see my dad and he did drive us. But I don't think he would have drove that far. If it was Cornwall way. It might actually be a seagull. I feel like you shouldn't... Uh, uh, I out. A seagull won't, won't hoot. <laughs> I'm pretty sure, Crunk. Now, I could be wrong. I'm not an expert. But I'm pretty sure a seagull would not hoot. <laughs> Maybe get things mixed up with child holiday places. I mean, you honestly, Fright, you could be spot on. It's been so long, I legit don't remember where it is or which direction it was in. Like, how far is Legoland from us? Because I guess if it's that same sort of time in the car, then maybe it could have been. But I just don't think he would have taken me that far. Because he was a bit of a stingy cunt. Right, this seems like the right way. I'm going to go back this way. Lego in Windsor, yeah? Yeah, wh whichever the closest one is to us, we went there. That's where I lost my baseball hat. Sad times. So a couple of hours, three hours more. Oh, so maybe it is. Maybe it was like Dorset area then. I want to have a quick look. That's my chrome. Uh... The thing is, there's no saying it's still open either. Because there's a Hawks Conservancy, uh, Conservancy Trust in Andover. There's a Falconry place in Salisbury, but I don't think it was that. Might have been the one in Andover. But again, I can't tell because I don't know how long this one's been open. And this was like t 10, like, like 17 years ago. But yeah, I don't know if it's still one that's around or not. But yeah, I that was a really fun time. I like birds. They're really nice. Right. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much right. I'm like, yep. Yeah. Right, I'm going to actually quickly BRB because I need to take a quick toilet break. So I will be back with you in a moment.
Right, okay. Fry, that the Warhammer animated you put in, that's the thing that Mr. Gore sent me. I remember now. Yeah, because I remember, I, I think I, he either sent me the full video or I might have watched multiple videos of it all together. But yeah, I remember watching that a little while ago. It's pretty good. of notifications right thank you dokey Do I have anything I can disenchant? I don't think I do, right? No, I'm not getting rid of that. It's fine, I'll take the trap. The trap ain't gonna kill me, so that's fine. Money. Hey, light armor up to 69, no? Oh, okay, well that guy's high by you know, nowadays and shit was ripped from YouTube way back when. Ah. Fuck. No. 
Oh my god! Uh, Alright, okay, that's fine. Don't worry about it. Right, okay, I think we're good. Hashtag fuck you game workshop. Anyways, yes. Talent they have, but for live action use, eh, no thank you. And I know where I was get where I know where it was getting mixed up. Okay. Yeah, I can't remember what it was that Mr. Why Mr. Gore sent that over. I know we were talking about Warhammer to some degree. But yeah, he sent that over. I think we might have actually been talking after I watched that first uh, Warhammer for Dummies video. New Forest Wildlife Pass has birds, but no public hands on. Forest Valkyrie into Salisbury is hands on bird place. It could be that one then. Yeah. I remember specifically that you could hold a couple of owls and a vulture when I went. Box. Owl and snake, I think that is. Yeah, see... Salisbury sounds about right. Because I doubt my dad would have drove me really far. <laughs> for something. Smell that. Blood. Get right up close. Fighting got him. already know that. Pretty stamina by 70? That's pretty good. That's pretty good. So I'll take it. A new two hander, more than happy. You ever done picks around Bewley Panda? I uh, I haven't been to Bewley since I was like a very young child. Um. Uh, ah! Um, yeah, no, I've, I've been to the car place a few times, but this was like way, way back when. That's why I was kind of surprised to see that there was a train. Because I don't recall there ever being a train there before. But I mean, if there is and it doesn't take too long, it sort of like leaves me open for like an idea of like being like, maybe that could be something I could go at another point, maybe. Cool, right, that's that quest done. Right, so I want to go do thingy. 
Uh, I would like to go do Dark Brotherhood, but I want to drop some stuff off. Um, actually, I should be fine for a while. Yeah. Some potential most places for picks near enough. Yeah. I didn't even realise that I could get a train that would sort of like lead me to to the new forest. Cause I think there's like Dean something. If I got off there, there's a part I oh, know that might be a different one. There's a specific station and it's like a bit of a walk away and you can get to the new forest. I didn't realize that was a thing. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me for the sins of the unworthy one. You've come at last. I knew you would. Are you all right? It worked. I knew you'd come. I just knew it. I did the black sacrament over and over with the body and the things. And then you came, an assassin from the Dark Brotherhood. Yeah, that's me. Yeah, of course, the Black Sacrament. It's so long, so very long. But now that you're here, you can accept my contract. Contract? My mother, she, she died. I, I'm all alone now. So they sent me to that terrible orphanage in Riften, Honor Hall. The headmistress is an evil, cruel woman. They call her Quellard the Kind. But she's not kind. She's terrible to all of us. So I ran away and came home and performed the Black Sacrament. Now you're here and you could kill Grelod the Kind. Okay. All those quests. I'm kind of lonely here. As much as I hated getting sent to Honor Hall, I really miss my friends. Alright. Uh, Riften, right? Yeah. Seen the old as upset about anything. Here to get All right, should be over here the orphanage. Those who shirk their duty will get an extra beating. Do I make myself clear? Yes, yes really. And one more thing. Nobody needs you. Nobody wants you. That, my darlings, is why you're here. Why you will always be here. Until the day you come of age and get thrown into that wide, horrible world. Now, what do you all say? We, we love, love you, you darling. darling. Thank you for your kindness. Thank you for your kindness. That's better. Now scurry off. What you fucking get? Talk shit to children like that. Bye.
I feel like there's another way you could do that quest, but I don't care. I'm gonna kill. <laughs> I am a Dark Brotherhood member now. We don't question. We just do. We do, 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 do. That bow, though. It is a pretty decent bow. Not gonna lie. I'm glad Morph told me where it was so I could get it. Also means less weight. Because I have to have a real bow. I have no arrow, so my menu's a lot cleaner. Well, where had the time? Is she, you know? She's dead. Uh -huh. I knew you could do it. I just knew it. I knew the Dark Brotherhood would save me. Here, just like I promised, this should set you a nice price. Oh, thank you. Thank you again. What now? Since that Imperial Craven ran me through from behind. I've been a bit out of sorts since. Since I saw this. Now those dogs have left. Did you look behind the forge? I think I saw it there. Oh, my own Halifax farm. Now that you mention it, I think. It's honest work, this bit of dog. Wait, so, wait, how do I start the Dark Brotherhood quest? I thought that's what I thought that's what I had to do. I lost my twin sister Did I fuck the quest up? I made my fortune as a teacher, but now I'm in the house. Let me try leaving the area. I wonder if a courier will come. Sleep or fast travel, I believe. I tried waiting. Try sleeping in a minute. I just want to try selling some stuff. Welcome to the pawn frog. Come on in, take a welcome to trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Oh. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's. Yeah, got this note. From who? I don't know. Creepy fella. Black. There we go. Couldn't see his I was gonna say. Uh, uh, I can't remember really how it started. It's been so long since I played this. Like that's it. Got to go. We know. 
Is that it? Welcome back. Good to see you again. Bountiful. Although I would like to have entered his place in exchange. Yes. Yeah, I'm confused. <sighs> Alright, okay. How to join the Dark Brotherhood? Oh! Sleep in a bed! Okay, cool. This is fine. Right, let's go to the inn and we'll sleep. Oh, I thought I said. I assume you saw. It's part of the Temple of Kinaret. People won't scan it. Here, you can look at this. Some of the Yard's men came by and left the, the companion in your Vastu? Sure thing. It's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room right this way. Need anything else? I did get another bounty letter, but I don't know what one it was. What does that mean? When he met the shield maiden Matilda, who said, Oh, you talk and you lie and you drink all of me. Now I think it's high time that you lie down and bleed. So then came clapping in. Well. What? Where am I? Who are you? You're warm, dry, and still very much alive. That's more than can be said for old Grelad. Hmm? You know about that? Of Skyrim knows. Old hag gets butchered in her own orphanage. Things like that tend to get around. They don't know who done it. I misunderstand. I'm not criticizing. It was a good kill. Old crone had it coming. And you saved the group of urchins to boot. To boot! Is a slight I like that word, to boot. Problem. You see, that little Eratino boy was looking for the Dark Brotherhood. For me and my associates. Grelod the Kind was, by all rights, a Dark Brotherhood contract. A kill that you stole. A kill you must repay. And you want me to murder someone else? Who? Well now, funny you should ask. If you turn around, you'll notice my guests. I've collected them from... Well, that's not really important. The here and now. That's what matters. You see, there's a contract out on one of them, and that person can't leave this room alive. But, uh, which one? Go on. See if you can figure it out. Make your choice. Make your kill. I just want to observe and admire. All right, I'll do it. I'll kill one of them. I knew we could resolve this civilly. A debt owed must be repaid. You understand that? Well, get to it then. Pick your guest and send the poor fool to the void. I'll give you the key to this shack and you'll be on your way. The anticipation is killing me. Can you figure out who has the contract? Which one will you choose? I, I who are you? My name is Fulltide. I'm a soldier. 
well, mercenary, really. You know, a, a, a sellsword. I've lived in Skyrim all my life. That's all. I'm a nobody, really. So, can't you just let me go? Someone paid to have you killed? Oh, God. I don't want to die. Shh. Oh. Don't be afraid. You can tell me. Okay, well, I guess it's possible. I've been selling my sword arm for years now. It kills a lot of people. Could be someone wanted revenge. But, uh, but you're not going to kill me, right? Whoever did this. You're all going to die down here. This is not the first time I have been bagged. Possibly, Morph. Who are you? Varsha, at your service. Obtainer of goods, taker of lives, and defiler of daughters. Oh, my, oh okay. Heard of me. Perhaps I will have my people carve my name in your corpse as a reminder. Maybe this one. Me? <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> the real question is, would someone pay to have me killed? I guess. A day goes by without someone trying to cut me in the street. Mm. I get disappointed. <laughs> Tell you what. Cat you away. Me, and I Stealing a woman from her home. Who are you? Your damn well, secrets, who I am. If you're going to kill me, just do it already. Oh, damn. If Mara is my witness, if I didn't have this hood on right now, I would piss right in your face. Well, that's just nasty. Would I have paid to have you killed? Me? What kind of question is that? All right, just tell me what I need to know. I'm a woman living in Skyrim with six children and no husband. I don't have the time or the patience to be nice. Do some people look down on me? Have I made? Oh, she's just a mum. It'd have to be the one on the right then. Hmm. Done. to jeez. Cat like that was sure to have enemies. It's no wonder you chose him. You told me to kill and I killed. Indeed. For you, my friend, seem to understand what's truly important. When I give an order to spill blood, you follow it. No questions, no remorse. Feel free to go. Of course. And you've repaid your debt in full. Here's the key to the shack. But why stop here? I say we take our relationship to the next level. I would like to officially extend to you an invitation to join my family, the Dark Brotherhood. In the southwest reaches of Skyrim, in the pine. I already know where it is. I stumbled upon it by accident the other day. <laughs> When questioned by the Black Door, answer with the correct passphrase, Silence, my brother. Then you're in, and your new life begins. I'll see you at home. Wait, what? Where's the quest marker? I thought the Dark Brotherhood was somewhere else.
Why, what's close by? I didn't see no enemies. Oh, a slaughterfish. Stuck on something. Okay, cool. <laughs> I don't know what happened there, but it's fine. Right, it says right over here. Okay, to foul clarify, it is his. So yeah, I did. I did say that we'd be playing Skyrim for December. So if we happen to finish the DLC and stuff, like, and we still have like a week of December streams, I'll probably just play like I'll just do random quests. Uh, I won't be starting the actual next game until we hit January. What is the music of life? Silence! I am quite looking forward to playing Birth by Sleep. Ah, at last. I hope you found the place all right. So what happens now? Well, what happens now is you start your new life in the Dark Brotherhood. You're part of the family, after all. This, as you can see, is our sanctuary. You won't find a safer place in all of Skyrim. So get comfortable. I'm honored to be a part of your family, Astrid. Our family, my dearest. Our family. Together, united as one, the Dark Brotherhood can accomplish anything. But you must be anxious to get to work. I'm arranging a job, but need a bit more time. For now, go see Nazir. He's got several smaller contracts. Soon, the Night Mother will arrive. And things around here are sure to get even Oh, shit! Dark Brotherhood has that really annoying jester, doesn't it? A welcome home present. The armor of the Dark Brotherhood. May it serve you well in all your... endeavors. yourself when you I love that jester of course she would I mean, we literally talked about if you could have clothes from any video game character, one of them that Neff chose was the Jester from Soul Calibur. That's one, two, six. It's not as good. member of our dwindling dysfunctional little family yes heard quite a bit about you it's a pleasure to meet you save the niceties for now 
I have no intention of getting invested in someone who may be dead tomorrow. If we're still breathing in a few weeks, I'm sure we'll be the best of friends. Asher said you have some work for me? Did she now? Well, as it turns out, there are a few lingering contracts we haven't had the chance to complete just yet. And more, dribbling in from time to time. I'll assign them to you as they become available. To be completed at your leisure. Sounds simple enough. It is. These aren't particularly glamorous assassinations, though, but they'll keep you busy. You can turn each one in as it's completed, or wait and turn. I'll teach you how to use it effectively and keep you. Oh, fucking hell. Well, then, your targets are the. When you've completed all those, we'll see if I might have some more. What did I learn? Welcome, my sister. Welcome to our sanctuary. You have made the right choice. You just trust in Astrid. Once I ah, but the, I am a trained killer. And once again, I'll kill March for death. Oh, what's that one? Oh, that's pretty good, actually. So, we gotta go kill some people. Should be pretty easy though. My sneak's really high, and I've got my bow. I've been looking for you. Well, there's a new lady in charge of the orphanage in Rift. Looks like that's it. I've got to go. All hail the dragon pool. I'll be able to make quick work of this as well, where my uh, my stuff is up pretty high. My stealth has, has got me covered quite a bit, to be fair, so... It's pathway. Booyah! Run ass! <laughs> oh, I need to do the Civil War stuff as well.
I forget that's a thing in this. Wait, why did I get a bounty? No one saw me kill it. People think they might have saw me, but they said I was fucking hidden. So I'm just saying. They say that vampires attack the hall of vision. Turn into the crowd. Why are people after me? I... They didn't see me kill him. Well, the first lot, anyone. First lot done, anyway. I'm back. Cicero, that's the name. Ugh. Haven't you talked to Astrid? She's by the pool greeting the night mother and her little jester. Oh. Welcome here, Cicero, and you will be afforded the respect deserving of your position as prophet. Understood, husband? <sighs> oh, yes, yes, yes! Thank you, thank you, thank you! But make no mistake, I am the leader of this sanctuary. My word is law. Are we clear on that? Mistress, perfectly. You're the boss. Ah, there you are. Good. I was done speaking with that muttering fool anyway. We've got some business to discuss. Do you have a contract for me? I do indeed. You must go to the city of Markov and speak with the apothecary's assistant. You'll probably find her in the hag's cure when the shop is open. The girl's been running her mouth. Wants an ex-lover killed. She's apparently performed the Black Sacrament. Her name is Miriam. I need you to talk to her, set up the contract, and carry it out. Oh, anything else? Do whatever the contact wishes. Be professional, represent us well, and get the job done. 
Since it's your first contract, I'll let you keep whatever Muiri pays. She'll be generous, I'm sure. They always are. Okay. Me? I've been part of the Dark Brotherhood from the day I first hatched. Should I be concerned that the, her husband doesn't wear shoes? You reek of death, my friend. Congratulations. Here's your payment. Need something? Oh, I could do this all day. Good. Your payment for a job well done. Still here. What's the matter? Good. Your payment for a job well done. Go on now. Perfect. Does death not come to us all? Is it not a certainty? I am Bam, 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 bam. Go. Take care of the Muiri contract. There will be plenty more to come from this one. All right, more clef. <sighs> do, 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 do. Ma, na, 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 na. <laughs> How about a septum? You have Wait, plenty of strong make that drink two septums. I feel like living it up. Why are you looking at me like that? The Dark Brotherhood has come, Nori. Oh, oh, I... Thank goodness you're really here. The Black Sacrament. It actually worked? Obviously. Now tell me what you need. What I need is for Elaine Dufault to die. I want him hunted down and murdered like the dog he is. Why, Sifis, I need details. Get to the point. I didn't know it when we were with each other, but Elaine is actually the leader of a band of cutthroats. Bandits. They're holed up in some old dwarven ruin. Ralgvathar. It's near Windhelm. They use it as their base. It's where they stage their raids. I want you to go to that ruin, find Elaine Dufont, and kill him. I don't care about his friends. Do whatever you want with them. But Elaine has to die. It will be done. Excellent. Once Elaine is dead, I'll pay you. In gold. But, well, there is one more thing. If you're interested. Listening? If you can, I want you to kill someone else as well. You don't have to, not as part of our deal. But if you do, I'll pay you even more. It's Nilsen Shattershield in Windhelm. If Nilsen dies too, I'll make it worth your while. Tell me the full story. To Windhelm to see the Shatter Shield. Oh. Old and dear friends, and in mourning. Frigga was killed recently. Murdered. I met Elaine in the tavern while I was drinking my sadness away. She was handsome and charming. He said I was the beautiful lily of his dreams. Elaine made all the pain just go away. But it was all lies. Elaine used me. He ruined my name. Do you know why Elaine was in Windhelm? He heard about Frigga. Elaine used me to get close to my friends. Okay. And now they all think I'm some kind of monster. Elaine Dufont took my life. I'm going to be a silver one. I'm not going to question why she wants people killed. I'll just do the job.
Nothing to see here. Old dwarven ruin. Look at that. Oh, no. So fucking moving every time I shoot. There we go. Cheating over here. Oh, don't, don't, don't. Don't, don't. Ebony Grey Sword. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. I think I'm just going to stick with the one-handed. Okay, so I managed to kill them, but now we're at the predicament that I can't get around to the bit that I thought I could get around to from there. It's like it might be up that path. Shit. Hmm, okay. Is there an enemy nearby?
win, I'll be no, 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 no. May your next fight bring you victory. Leave then. You have my steel. My blood's calm. I prefer it boiling. Fine. Let's trade then. I can't send into my house. It used to, I swear like before when I played this, if you owned a house, you could send them to the house rather than send them where you got them. Yeah, strange. There's no point looting them either because I've got like loads of money and they're not going to give me too much anyway, I don't think. I'm trying to block me. They don't know what they're up against. Under Panda. Or Flick, I mean. No one ever expects Flick. Keep an eye out for chests, otherwise, yeah, I probably won't loot the bodies. Done and done. Chess is fucking empty.
Blood's calm. I prefer it boiling. All right, mate. No! I've got to go back so far now! Uh. I was like, should I save the game? Nah, I'll be alright. It'll be fine. Panda's an idiot. No mercy for you, sir. None. Yeah, I'd rather do it this way and then I can get like the extra bits that I was getting before. Yeah. So I don't want any of those. Did you see this here last time? I need an amulet of RK for a quest. Yeah. Cool.
Actually, did I rob this woman? She had a key when I checked before. Well, she doesn't now. But what is the point of doing this? Yeah, what is the point of coming here? I am curious. Uh, maybe it's just another pathway for you to leave. Oh, wait, no, that's a deep market. Is it could take me down? Nah, you're right. My blood's calm. I prefer. <laughs> no, thank you. We don't have to go that way, so we're not going to. Dabba -de -dabba -dabba -dabba. But what we could probably do is get back to Murray, hand that in, talk to Astrid, and then we'll call it there. And then tomorrow we'll carry on with the Dark Brotherhood stuff. Which sounds like a good plan. Oh. I did read that book. Okay. I just want to check because I couldn't remember if I had or not. Lock picking at 79. Oh. The Silverblood Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. Don't mind her yelling. My parents are always going at each other. Oh my. Well, what now? <laughs> Is Elaine? He is dead. Thank you. That bastard got exactly what he deserved. And I heard about Nilsine. You have more than fulfilled your part of the... I'll never forget you. I mean, ideally, don't remember us because, you know... I don't want to have to kill you. Thanks, Sarah. A little bit awkward, right? <laughs> cool. We've got a ring that gives us better potions as well when we're crafting, which 
might go handy if I want to like do some like alchemy grinding off stream or something. Ah, oh, you're back. So, how went your first real contract? A bit more exciting than what Nazir's been offering, I'd wager. It was fun. I did what had to be done, nothing more. I only live to serve Helsifis. Oh, very good. Very good indeed. You, my dear, are going to fit in here quite nicely. Now, I need your assistance <sighs> with a matter of a more mm, personal nature. Is something wrong? It's Cicero. Ever since he arrived, his behavior's been, well, erratic would be an understatement. I do believe he is truly mad, but it's worse than that. He's taken to locking himself in the Night Mother's chamber and talking to someone in hushed but frantic tones. Who is he speaking with? What are they planning? I fear treachery. I said this, we must stop them. So you understand my fear. If Cicero's planning something and conspiring with one of our own, it would be disastrous. What do you want me to do? Dear sister, I need you to steal into that chamber and eavesdrop on their meeting. It'll be no use clinging to the shadows. They'll see you for sure. Now, you need a hiding place. Somewhere they'd never think to look. Like inside the Night Mother's coffin. Yes, the coffin is perfect. Think to check it. Who in their yes, that's about right. Sure. Now go before they meet and report back to me with whatever you learn. Right then. Right then. Oh, right. So, that means tomorrow when we start playing this, we'll start off with that quest. And then we'll make our way through the Dark Brother. Um, the plan is, if... I don't think we will. I know, I'm not saying that we're going to get through this super easy. But obviously, where it's mostly the, the guild stuff, I don't remember them all being, like, massively long. And, like, especially where I'm, like, a bit more of a lot bigger level, I might be able to breeze through some of the stuff compared to usual. Um, so I think if we manage to finish the, if we manage to finish the Dark Brotherhood, or I say when, I'm not saying we'll finish it tomorrow, but when we do the Dark Brotherhood, I'll jump into the College of Winterhold, and then we'll do Companions last, and then I need to do the Civil War stuff, and then we'll jump in Dawn Guard, and then do Dragonborn. And we're only, for the DLCs, I'm only doing the main story anyway. So, yeah. Good night. I appreciate it, Fright. I appreciate it. I am... It's going to be an exciting one. I'm going to go get some dinner, but I get to open the Christmas presents that Rube's got me. So, I get to see all of that. I'm quite excited. I'm curious to see what she got me. So I've got to sort all of that out. We are going to send the love over to Jeannie. She's playing some Last of Us Part 2. We haven't raided her in a little bit. So I want to send the love over to there. Hopefully you'll all stick with me and wish her the best. But yeah, we're sending love over to Jeannie. I will be back tomorrow. Um, I'm hoping to start about 10 or just after 10 o'clock. It all comes down to... When I get home. If not 10, it'll be just after 10. But we will be streaming tomorrow for sure. So look forward to that. Otherwise, yeah, if you haven't, as always, there's, of course, all my links. Um, yeah. I appreciate you all. Thank you. And good night. <laughs>